What's up guys, Matt Nuzzo here at the Real Flagship Store in Cape Hatteras, North Carolina. I'm gonna to talk to you about the new Core Sensor 2 S and S Plus bars. Okay, so Sensor 2 S and S Plus are pretty much the exact same bar with one difference. So they both come stock with 24 meter lines. On the Plus, you have line extensions that basically cut down every two meters. So if you want 22s, you can take off those line extensions down to 18 meters. So on the Plus, you can alter those lines from 24, 22, 20 to 18. Why you would do that? Uh, but different people like different line lengths. You know, some for short kites like to really loop them. Some, you know, you, some people just have a, it's a personal preference when uh, to change the size of the wind window. That's the only reason you'd go to the Plus. Um, also for teaching, sometimes we'll use those shorter lines because it cuts the wind window down. So this bar is really, really sweet. Very simple and very precise and great quality product. So a few features on this. You've got the twist uh, release, which is really nice because if you're fully pulled in here like this, a push away release sometimes can get jammed. This will always release because it's a twist. Uh, when I first got these bars, I was like, twist release, you're out of your mind. These things are gonna, I'm gonna quick release these things like crazy. Still have yet to false release, which was really rely, uh, which is really important. But also when I twist the thing, boom, it, it, with uh, easy pressure, it, it will twist right off for you. Uh, the bars do come with a nice bar bag and also a nice short leash as well. You can see right here on my harness. Uh, they have a smaller chicken loop here, um, chicken bone here. Pretty typical. Your safety system is gonna come in underneath the bar. Uh, they do make an accessory kit for a larger loop and then also something to set up a suicide leash for people who are doing unhooked tricks. So you can get that as an accessory kit. Um, some of the things that they've really updated on the 2S and 2S Plus here is the line here that goes through the bar. So they have a really thin line covered in plastic, but it's super, super strong with no stretch. So covering in plastic, you're gonna get no more wear and tear. Also, underneath here, you see the swivels underneath here, so your lines automatically just untwist when you spin your kite or loop your kite. You'll never have any center line twist going up the, uh, going up the center lines there. Uh, this here, they've put in ceramic, uh, you know, a few ceramic washers, and what that does is makes it really buttery. On previous versions, they had stainless in here, and sometimes it would jam up, like I never rinse my stuff or never don't take care of it that well. And, you know, after using the bars for a year, leaving it in the back of my truck, you know, I had a couple kind of, kind of not freeze up, but just get a little stiffer, whereas this thing is super buttery. That combined with the stiffer plastic sheathing, the thing's constantly unwinding before you even get a twist in the lines. Uh, the bar, really comfortable grip, skinny diameter. Uh, it does have an adjustable bar end, so it's a 46. If you were to pull this out, you can take the float off and there's adjusters underneath the float. Uh, don't wanna do it right now because I'm connected to the kite, uh, but you can do that. And then you can connect to this side, we'll give you a 46 uh, centimeter bar, and then on the outside is 52. I pretty much use the 52 on everything. I use the 52 on the 17 uh, and 19 meter kites, all the way down to the five and four meter kites. So, um, you know, for teaching again, I'll go down to that 46 for the really small kites, but pretty much personal riding, I'm using the 52 setting for everything. Above the bar here, you've got above the bar depower, really nice, simple, easy, buttery depower. Uh, they've added this bungee line here, so it kind of shocks back so you don't have that line dangling around. And then also Velcro end here, goes right on there, taps up. Underneath the floats, you've got adjuster, so you can uh, change and adjust those lines. Um, and then you've got a really cool center line flagging safety system. So you can see here, this just hooks up right to the center line. And we're gonna demo how this thing releases and it does flag out the kite without having the bar race all the way up. So it's easy to get the, everything back together, reassemble, still very reliable and safe because it fully flags your kites, even the big ones, but also your bar is in a complete mess afterwards. Uh, a little insider information is that these little bungees here on the end, uh, they're nice bungees. The winders are pretty small, so you have to wrap the lines pretty tight. Like all this stuff, I kind of wrap figurating around the center and then the, the, the bar. You want to have a smaller winder just so it's not like uh, real bu bulky and I, you know, like, you know, so it won't like hit you or anything. But it is a little tricky to get the lines wrapped up really pre precise and perfect. These little uh, bungees here, um, they're good. They'll go around the line. Sometimes I've had um, one of my bars, it's just elastic. So sometimes I had one of them break off. That was a previous bar, you know, after I used it for a really long time. Uh, overall, the, the bar setup too, you're going to get a very precise, solid feel. Uh, this has all equal lines, so you can fly this, uh, the Sensor 2S bars on any kite on the market that flies on equal lines, which is pretty much everything. Uh, there is a fifth line conversion kit if you want to ride a, on a, a C kite um, that you can get it on this as well. 
overall, really, really good quality product. Uh, psych with this bar, the center line swivel is really sweet, the safety is really reliable, lines strong, precise, uh, simple adjustments, it's clean, simple, there's no like big bulky floats or any sort of garbage, springs and all this unnecessary junk that's going on in a lot of bars. It's just a simple, clean bar that they keep making better. More reviews, check us out at realwatersports.com and we'll see you on the water.